Hi, Hiram here. Today I'm going to try a boil test using my uh, Froop stove. This will be the first test. The one I'm using here is the one with the big holes on the inside. For a stand, I'm just going to use the stand from the Swiss M1 stoves. Remember I did that before I told you to hang on to these even after the stove is gone. It fits real nice on the top of this. I could use a wire cage too, but I just want to see how well this thing works. So what I have here is the half a cup of wood pellet. Stick it in there. I have part of the half a cup of the wood pellets. They've been soaking in alcohol to use as an accelerant to start this up. It's a little windy out here today, so I'm hoping. I'm using my wind shield here. People have asked me about this. It was a cookie sheet, I think, that I got from Goodwill. A foldable cookie sheet. And it works pretty good for protecting the stoves and stuff. Just put this on there. Let this heat up, build up a little bit. The weather here right now is outside. It's 79 degrees with uh, drop down to about 60% humidity. It's windy and cloudy. Be interesting to see where this goes. It's a little hard to, you know, get everything all uniform when you're doing it outside versus on the bench top. But we'll give it a try. Right now the alcohol is still burning in there. It's all going to blow away on me. Okay, maybe that's going. Let me put the water on. I have two cups here. Setting at 59 degrees. Let's see where this goes. Okay, there we have 210. It's not exactly the fastest stove I've ever had. 211. Might be because of the uh, pot stand part. Maybe I should have used something like this. I think that's blocking the air. 12 and 14 minutes. So that was two cups of water starting at 59 degrees. The outside temperature here is 79. And it brought the two cups of water to boil in 14 minutes. Like I said, not the fastest stove I've ever done. But you figure if you're getting your material for free, along the trail. That's not too bad. Let me pour this out and we can see what the bottom of the pot looks like. Huh. Quite sooty and you know the regular stuff that you'd get using wood. So the flame's still going pretty good. Lots of wood pellets still in there. I have an idea. I think... I think what I want to do... The inside can is like this. It's a large soup can, or rather a soup can. 
when you put wood, put wood pellets in there, the wood pellets only come up about halfway, so it's got a long way to, to burn out. I think I'm going to use a shorter can in there. Like that. To uh, pull the wood up a little bit. But anyway, so there we got it. It's still burning. Yeah, that is quite a way down. So that was two cups of water starting at 79 degrees, no, 59 degrees. And I put the pot on right away. I didn't wait for it to build up or anything. But it finally got to boil in 14 minutes. So of course I'm going to have to do a couple more tests with this, modifications, whatnot. See what what I can do to help build this up or shorten up the time. So I thank you for watching. I look forward to your input, questions, remarks, helpful suggestions. And as always, watch for my buddy Max. Bye now.